Hey guys, welcome back. This is Chosen Architect, and today we're going to be mining, but not normal mining. All right, guys, so let's hop right on in here. Uh, back where we were, the only thing I did was I went out and I killed that freaking golem thing that was out there. And when I did, I got this message that says, Chosen Architect, get revenge on an ancient golem. And I got these two blocks. And I don't exactly know what they're used for yet. I guess they're just uh, decoration. Unless there's some kind of crafting. Um, I can do at embers. And see what embers is all about. Embers looks like it is a... Some kind of magic mod. Almost looks like... Uh, some kind of... Some kind of replacement for... Um, for Thomcraft almost. It's kind of got that Thomcraft feel, especially with these blocks right here. Ancient ash blocks. But yeah, pretty neat stuff. I'm so excited to get, get through some of these mods. Uh, today, we, I want to get a basic farm up and running. Uh, something that we can just basically survive off of. Uh, the one thing that I did do, I went out and I killed a bunch of sheep. So I have a bit of mutton, and uh, yeah, it's going to do for now. That should last quite a while. Yeah, I just walked around, killed a bunch of sheep. Uh, also, notice we have a slime uh, island, like, right near us. Also, there's a bunch of apple trees near us. So, we got pretty lucky there. I know I have a stone pick. There we go. Uh, but yeah, we have a bunch of stuff. There's also a temple next to us. And I think we're going to go check that out today. I, th I think I can survive it. Hopefully, I can survive it. If I'm lucky, I can, and uh, we're going to do that here in a minute. Just want to kind of clear out and get some more coal. Uh, so I can get some more torches. The more coal I have, the better. The, those mini torches really do come in handy. Especially since you can get so much more torches, or so many more tor torches out of just one block of coal. I think uh, one block of coal will get you eight torches versus four. So yeah, actual additions, love that mod, specifically for that one thing. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get down in here, nice and dark. All right, so we got quite a bit. Look at that nine levels. That's a little bit from uh, killing a few things though. There we go. Nah, I did not want that. Oh man. Well, I have shears in case I need to shear some sheep. But I did not need to do that. I actually got to go out and actually let's uh, let's upgrade. Let's take this out. Let's go ahead and upgrade it to a. Oh, don't burn that up. I actually need that. Looks like we only have one stick. Uh, what I'm gonna do? Oh, we need to sleep. It's already nighttime. I love these uh, new emotes as well. Those are pretty cool. You check those out. You have an emote page right here. You can click, and if you're an F5, like this, you can actually emote. This is pretty cool. I like that they added a menu. Headbang, that's awesome. So yeah, those would be pretty neat on a server, for sure. In single player, eh, not so much. Um, wonder, oh, it has to be diamond. We can get that later. Ooh, there's some some bone just waiting for us right here. All right, so we need to get some trees and avoid that guy. Boy, he's been he's been after me. There we go. Got him. One piece for all that work. All right, we're gonna need a bunch of bunch more wood. I should have gathered some wood off camera. That would have helped out a lot. Alright, so we're gonna gather this stuff up. I'd really like to upgrade my... my axe. That'd be a lot better. That'd make things a whole lot better. Um, yeah, we're gonna go visit that island too. I kinda wanna... or go to that temple. I kinda wanna go check that out. And, uh... Somebody in the comments told me a good way of checking this thing out right here 
It looks like it's not going to be that bad. It doesn't look very large. It's kind of right there on the edge of the water. Hopefully that didn't mess anything up. Those bunnies with the tuxedos on, they're just killing me. Alright, not even gonna go through a door. Alright, so what do we got in here? Hopefully there's no traps. Alright, so this just takes you up to the top. That would be normally how I would go through it. Be up there. These guys have nothing in them. Okay, so apparently you can, instead of going down here, which is apparently a bad idea, going down the middle is a bad idea. Yeah, because of that pressure plate down there. So I guess you can just go down the side. Just as long as you don't touch that pressure plate. Because that would be a bad deal. Um... Couple torches. That'll help. And look, there's a there's a couple chests. Ooh, there's lava right there. Okay, so that's all we're going down right now. Is that enough for me to? Oh. Okay. So we got some string. We got some uh, squid beak. And we got this bronze sword. And some gunpowder. I'll actually take the gunpowder. And uh, can I check this one? Looks like we got a zombie heart. We got um, Enderium shard. Mm. A bronze pickaxe. I'll take the pickaxe. I was hoping there was going to be a pickaxe in this. So now I can actually get down here. Ooh, there's some diamonds right away. Perfect. I will take that, and there is a bee from Forestry. Um, some more sand. Uh, three emeralds, I will take that up front, no problem. And I can get this armor on, at least we'll have a piece of armor. Golden apple, will not complain. There's some modest drones. Don't know if I want to get into the bees. Ooh, there's a uh, fuel efficiency, that must be for something. Man, we got a bunch of gunpowder. That's really good. Because, uh, there's something nice we can make with that. I, I want to... I guess I'll take the sand. And, uh, everything else... The Lotus from Batania, I'm not that interested in. I'll take the gold. Um... The bronze sword. Same as the iron sword. So yeah, there's not really that much in here. I mean, the bees I might come for, come back later for, um, if I do get into that. But at the moment, not so much. I don't know what this Ender IO thing is. I've not used that. Don't turn it on, take it apart. Okay, and regularity, that's a new mod. Zombie Heart is one of the drops used for crafting. Um, drops from zombies, both regular and pigmen. Looks like charcoal and zombie heart in a apothecary mortar gives you poison essence, which gives you wither for 12 seconds. That's not something that I want. Um, also can be used in a uh, cross of mercy. Wonder what that thing is. And there's a uh, exorcism shot. Okay, and it gives you zombie flesh. Okay, so we got a bunch of stuff. I think that was a pretty good loot. Wasn't bad. Was not bad at all. Okay, so we're gonna hop back up here. Maybe we can find more of these. I'm sure they're gonna have about the same amount of loot in them. I'm sure. I don't think I crossed water to get here, so... Hey guy, I might as well kill you while I'm over here. Thank you. I will take your die, because I know I'll probably need it. You never know when you're going to need some black die. There we go. And you also get some calamari. 
There we go. Um, what do I want to get rid of? This one piece of dirt. There we go. I hope those other ones I didn't drop. Probably did. Looks real dark under here. I probably should uh, gather up some of this sand and stuff, some of this gravel, while I'm over here. Since I do have some slots for some sand, I might need to gather some sand. Um, I'm gonna use a sand for some mining since I have a bunch of that. Uh, since I have a bunch of that gunpowder now. There's a pretty cool way of mining that tier Tinker Construct provides. All right, so let's. I didn't pick any of that up. I just kind of want to stack, I guess. Be fine for now. Get us some glass. All right, so let's head back. I think I'm in this area. Hey, cows. I'll be back for you, Les, later. I'm back over this way. See, there's the island up there. We'll have to check that out eventually. Go up there and get that tree. All right. And it looks like there's some uh, some hills over here. Go ahead and take that. And didn't even give it to us. We have a full inventory. We gotta go back. I did not get that much wood, but uh, this should do. For now. All right. So that almost filled our saturation bar all the way. I wanted to put a torch down there. There's some more iron. Look at there. I would love to get enough iron so I could make a new pick in this episode as well. That'd be awesome if I could do that. And we might, man, with with just coming over here, this area is full of iron already. That's not that bad at all. All right, I might dig down just enough so I can use use some explosives if I have enough materials to make those things. I don't know what that's used for. Granerite? Or garn... Garnerite? What is that stuff? So it makes pulverized nickel. So it makes nickel. Okay. All right, so let's go back up. We can throw some of this stuff away. Put it in our chest. All right, we're gonna have to make make another chest for sure. All right, we just throw this out for now. There we go. I'll just throw everything in for now. We can sort through it later. All right, so we're gonna need some of this. I do have some bone now, but I was wanting to look at taking some sand, some gunpowder, and there's supposed to be under Tinker's Construct, under the tools, if I can find it. There we go. This right here, the EFLN. It looks like it requires one flint, one gunpowder. So I thought it was sand, but it's actually flint. Um, so we could go try and get some flint. Um, let me get that. We get all that good stuff. Um, we need one iron. Where's all my iron at? I thought I had iron. I did use some for a bucket. There it is. Um, and then we'll just get a stick. A couple sticks. And we'll make one, sh one nice shiny shovel. Um, also need to make an axe. Pick you up. Let's actually break this. Because we don't need this one anymore. We can actually upgrade this thing. There, now they will stay in the crafting station. Uh, not a big fan of this popping up showing the furnace for some reason. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and 
make that. Where's our iron? I kind of want to get make it out of iron. There we go. And uh, yeah, we'll get we'll get some more iron later. I did not mean to make another pick, but I guess we're getting another one. Anyways, all right. So I don't have enough to make. I'll just make it out of stone. That's fine. So I gotta watch what you're crafting, I guess. I was not focused. All right, so there we go. We're good. It looks like it's dark. Don't wanna do that. All right, we gotta get, gotta get going faster. Um, I'll take this just in case. Pop that in there, don't need this. Don't need that, that. All right, and I think we're good. Let's go get some sand, and we'll get some sand, and uh, where's my sword? Gotta have that just in case. There we go. All right, we got food on us. We got mini coal. All right, we need to go get some gravel. There should be gravel over here. The pig. There will definitely be some gravel down here. Fortunately, we gotta gotta go underwater. That's what I kind of don't want to do. It's hard to see underwater, especially for you guys. But it looks like there's some clay over here. I might need to grab that. I know I need to get that. Okay, that's got, I hear a skeleton. And I, th I think these beehives can actually hurt you if you stand near them. Yeah, they do. Yep, they do hurt. Okay, so we have no gravel, there's some gravel. Hopefully we can get some flint out of the gravel. There's a piece of flint. Okay. So one piece of flint out of all that gravel. I bet if we were mining in a, another biome, we could definitely get a bunch of gravel or a bunch of flint. I'm kind of looking for some gravel on the edge. So that's not going to be that hard to get. There we go. Whole bunch of it. We are cooking now. Look at all this gravel. All right, so I'm back. I got a bit of the stuff that we needed. Um, got some clay and all that good stuff that we're gonna need for Tinker's Construct, but I wanna get this uh, lovely thing going. Looks like we can make, I kinda wanna keep three of these in here. So that'll be fine. Um, but we should be able to put this in here. And we get 15 of these, or 12 of these explosives. Let's go ahead and put that back in there. And I should be able to stand back and hopefully not kill myself with this. Bam. Okay, uh, let's go get some sticks. That'd be really nice to get. Okay, there's that. Um, do I have more wood? Yeah, I got a bunch of wood on me. Because we're going to need... A bit of torches, so we don't get some mobs spawning down there where I'm blowing stuff up at. Okay, it looks like it went pretty deep down there. Do have a have bats spawning now? So hopefully, no mobs start spawning. Wow, that cleared out a lot of space, actually. Yeah, a lot of space. And I don't think it destroys the uh, actual blocks itself. 
This is a good way to mine early on. Um, I do think there's a cave over here. Yeah, I should be able to just throw this bad boy uh, in this general direction. Hopefully I don't have to stand too far back. Yeah, I love this already. So yeah, this is pretty neat. Look at this. Tons of resources already in our inventory. Bunch of cobblestone, though. Not liking that, but... Oh, well. Alright, so let's get rid of all this cobblestone. There we go. I hear a zombie super close. He's somewhere over here. But yeah, let's see how close we are to the ground. We're pretty far down now. Let's go ahead and blow this wall out. There we go. Pretty awesome. Alright, so we got zombies coming at us. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Alright, so he's gone. Let's see what we got over here. If I can make that jump, I should be able to. There we go. Nothing over here. All the good stuff's over in this direction. This is kind of where I wanted to go anyways. Whoa! Got skeletons falling from all over the place. Let's see, can I get all of them? <laughs> Got them all. Alright, so these guys are down here. Playing around. Alright, maybe I can... Get down on their level. The skeleton is the only one I'm worried about. These guys, not so much. Creepers, yeah, a creeper would probably kill me at this mo at this point. Um, but yeah, we're there. We go. We should be able to come get all this good stuff that's down here. Cobblestone, it's all in my way. All right, we're getting we're getting somewhere. We're doing some mining. We're looking good. I kind of want the gravel actually. It's a cobblestone. I'm not a big fan of right now. All right, we're getting. We should almost have enough iron to to get further with Tinker's construct. There's some yellow, right? Just mainly want the iron ore. That's all I want. I'm loving these TNT things, though. They are super powerful. Okay. Let me, uh... Let's see. There's probably a bunch of stuff in this wall right here. So, yeah. Let's just... Let's just dig out a giant area. Why not? So we have more torches. Alright, so I, I want to get rid of all the cobblestone. What is this stuff? Limestone, raw limestone. I already almost have a stack of... We have tons of flint now. I don't think flint's a problem anymore. Definitely need flint. I'll take all that I can get. 
What is this? I'll need marble. Alright, there's got to be a few more ore over here somewhere. Because we just blew out a big area. This looks like something nice. What is this? Modular force field system. Okay. So, with this nice area already dug out, ready to go. The only problem I, I see in my future is there's going to be tons of mobs spawning down here. Not going to be fun. But yeah, we just got tons of iron ore. Uh, in the next episode, I think we're going to work with some uh, Tinker's Construct, getting uh, our Tinker Construct system up and running, ready to go. Yeah, just got to head back home now. I think. I'm, all, I'm, I'm really close. Yeah, I'm right here. So yeah. Um, well, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please don't forget to click that subscribe button and also give this video a thumbs up. And as always, thanks for watching.